so that's what first exposed me to the fact that there's a lot of anime games out, or a lot of video games out there that are based off of anime. Because I was like, there's no way this exists. And it does exist. So I was like, fuck. Alright, I think from this place, I can go north and it'll take me right to the second floor. And I can use that to warp around, go right to the rooms. I can drop out there. Oh, we got this, guys. We got this down. Haha. <laughs> That's what happens when you actually know what the hell you're doing. Anyway. Actually, there is... I think there's only like two more places I need to go before I'm done with this game, actually. No, really. Just two. Oh god, those bats are chewing me out like you wouldn't believe. Back in here. <laughs> you might remember this room actually does look kind of similar to, uh... Wait, wasn't there a password that says someone near one? I don't think so. I'll check. I, I could... I could help you run. Asshole. I totally didn't remember he was there. I just guessed. I was like, there's bats in the other one. I think he's here. Yep, asshole. Hey, incoming dick. Anyway, gonna take this. Swing it around. Then go back downstairs. And we're good. So in terms of items right now. Got two cards? Yeah. Yeah, literally like the Italian section down there. That was literally just for the green gem. Actually, let me double check that. I think that was the case, right? Yeah, yeah. Now, the first floor is almost entirely cleared out. Oh, of course, there's one more item I need to get. And I'll be taking care of post-haste. Come on. <sighs> I, you know what? No, no, no. It's cool. I can afford to take the hit. I can afford to be chip damaged a little bit right now. Just a little bit. Because, again, you can just heal at any given time. It's not like... What was that game where I couldn't even heal while I was in the pause menu? It was something like Uzumaki Chronicles, wasn't it? Or, like, you couldn't heal certain times? I don't remember exactly. I, it's been a while since I played this Mocker Chronicles. You know, truthfully, there is actually still one more thing in the game I have to do at some point in time. <laughs> yep, Uzu Mocker Chronicles 1 isn't done, guys. There's one more thing I got you off of the game. I haven't done it yet. <laughs> Fuck me running. But anyway. Oh, I have to get back to the game, but anyway. Uh, next room. I am on the right track, right? Yeah, this is... I am not going in the right direction. I am not going in the right direction at all. You know what? Hang on. Just flat out kill this dude. Literally the only thing different about this fool, as opposed to all the rest, is that he, he's actually taking a few hits. Wow. Usually he went to go down like in three or four, but that... Woo! That took like it's all five or six. Damn. That was impressive. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, I, I got like all the blood pills in the world. I don't fucking care anymore. Well, I sh probably should. He's not gonna hit. He hit me, but you know what? That's so cool. It's weird. It's strange that like I noticed that in the movie when D was getting damaged by Carmilla, his vampire set actually started really kicking the high gear. So it's weird that this game, when you get hit, you actually lose vampire meter instead of gaining it. I, I'm like, I don't understand that. Shouldn't that be like a rage feature or like a comeback mechanic of some kind when you get damaged? But no, it's not. I, I don't understand honestly. But you know what? This game has enough on its, enough problems on its plate already. I won't add to the growing list. I'll just leave it alone. There is some points where you just gotta be like, okay, I, I, I concede. There's enough bullshit here. I'll just leave it as is. Speaking of bullshit, this fool. God damn. Why is this room so infested with monsters? Fuck. Yeah, look at this. I can't even attack. What the fuck? <laughs> this is legit bullshit right here. Like, no, this is actual legit gray bullshit right here. I got, I got the resources. Oh, all you motherfuckers are about to die. Also, I convinced that those like flying worm things are the wor worst enemies in the game because that spinning attack has like such a damn massive hitbox. Got him. Okay. Whew. That was it. Okay. All good. All good. <laughs> Actually, I just got to wonder myself. I wonder if the Vampire Under D Bloodlust movie actually has the trailer for the game on it. That'd be weird. Very strange, but you know what? Whatever. Alright. Almost there. I think this is it, actually. Level 2. Level 1. Yep, this is it. Okay. All areas in this game have been visited. Cool. By the way. Bats. Everywhere. Very good for getting Vampire Gage, not very fun to deal with. Ever. <laughs> no. Actually, hang on, while we're on the topic of bullshit, 
Oops. That's also bullshit. I forgot I had it still equipped. Ugh. It's the second time, only the second time this game that's happened to me, though. Cool. Next room. <laughs> this is far from being a flawless playthrough, guys. I'm sorry. Except, yeah, dig what you can get, right? Okay. That was that. Wait. Check this. Is already turned on? What does that mean? Oh, cool. I think the... I already entered vampire, right? I think. Let's find out. 50-50, right? We need a different password. <laughs> I wonder what it could be. <laughs> so damn difficult. I mean, it's not like it gave me the pass for the start of the game or anything, right? Actually, to be, truth be told, I really should have punched this in sooner. All right, that's forever. That's forever solved. I, I legitimately forgot that there's a security panel right there that I can use to immediately just access the room again. Oh, I'm, yeah. Legit mistakes were made. Uh, yes. I can. Sorry about that. Missions in the scoop. Okay. Everything in the game, except one area, is I'm cleared out. I can say that with a completely straight face. Except, well, on the main floors, yes. And where I'm about to go, no. Actually, where we're about to go is going to be back on the third floor, funny enough. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to cut back until I get to the third floor because I got something to do over there. Oh, boy. Went right, all right. I can't tell anymore. <laughs> be back in a second. Okay, back on the third floor. Now we're actually here. There's something that, <gasps> excuse me, I do want to go take care of. All right, I've been pretty much everywhere in here. I know where everything goes. However, the bottom right one still has not been used. Or is that the correct one? I don't remember. All right. Bottom left is the tower. Top right is another tower. Top left goes down to the basement. The one on the far left goes to the first floor. So is the other one. All right, so now it's legitimately a 50-50 shot between the two middle ones. I will wager the left one. <laughs> I'm not even going to be going there. By the way, while I was actually cutting out to get back here, I heard like a giant thunder strike outside. Holy crap. And we've been having that crap lingering over us all day. Mm. Arizona monsoon season for you guys. If you don't live it on in like the southwest area, oh, it's fun. Uh, you know, judging by the camera angle, I think I just went the wrong way. Uh, let's see what the survey says. Is that the case? Ooh, I felt that again. All right, is that it? No, it's not. But I could try it anyway, fuck it. Uh, you know what? Uh, hang on. I just thought maybe I can actually visually see it on my map. Uh, actually, I think I'm going the right way. I think. Um, shit. No, I'm probably not. You know what? It's a legit 50-50 chance I'm going to get it right or get it wrong. Let's just, you know, take it. Uh, <laughs> no harm, no foul, right? Ah, oh, God. I do wish that, like, these actually said specifically where they take you, depending on which one you get on or not. But sadly, I do not think that's the case. But, you know what? Eh, <laughs> screw it. Again, only 50-50 chance again is right, right? No time like the present. Ever. And consensus says, Bob's going to be wrong again. Because <laughs> I was pr doing pretty badly in the second recording session. Back when I was using Layla. Ugh. That was bad. Uh, gargoyle. This is not where I'm supposed to be going. Because this takes me back to the basement area. Yeah, I got it wrong. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> My bad. Uh, that was not good. <sighs> All right. Well, you know what? It's not good. I'll just quickly show you guys why I use the quickly traverse between these two areas. So I can... that's covered. Oh man, this is a solid hour just backtracking through the, the, everything prior. You know what? I think we're cool. I think we're cool, and the reason being is because I'm gonna get everything. I think I'm gonna get all the items actually. If not all the items, I'm going to be pretty fucking close. All the items, been to all the rooms, and I'm getting a 1% ending. I, I can say that without full confidence now. I can think of no reason I'm not going to get the 1% ending. I can fully say that with a straight face. 
No jinxing or anything. I think I'm in the clear for getting 1% ending. But anyway. Uh, next room. <laughs> God, I think I'm the only person who's legitimately let's playing this ass, given this much love into it. Because... Oh god, thinking back on it, there's like two dudes who legitimately did it, but one of them wasn't was kind of just like more enamored with the opening cutscene. One I didn't see the other one fully, but there was who was kind of just like a D joke right at the bat. Haha, <laughs> Vampire Hunter D. Hmm, D. I have not made that joke once yet, and I am very, very pleased with myself. Probably got some saving at something good anyway. And there was one dude who was like doing like a blind German run, so I'm like. I think I'm the <laughs> God damn it, Bob's saying ground again by being the only person to 1% a game that's never 1% percent before the other one being Dragon Blade Chronicles in this case. Uh I never mentioned that game was 1% by complete accident. That was entertaining as hell to do or <laughs> to come to realization of. Like, I just accidentally 1% on this entire game. Accidentally completed to its fullest. Yeah. Accidentally. <laughs> Oops, yeah, you know, sometimes things just happen. All right, yes, here I am. All right, back here, Uh, you guys that will probably more than likely remember this from when I was in Layla that I accidentally ended up here. This is actually the time you want to be coming back here because now is roughly the time when you can access it. Well, no, it's definitely the time you got to visit because you see these, purple gem, green gem, you need both of these that be inserted so the door will be unlocked. <laughs> I like when I actually yeah, talk to her again. There, but you can't take them out. Well, I probably could if I try hard enough, but I'm not going to right now because that'd be stupid. Because the door is already unlocked. I like if you just like leave a little rock in the door, keep it unlocked that way. I don't fucking. <laughs> it's locked from the outside, not the inside. Okay. Ooh, so dark and intimidating. Oh, it's just this. <laughs> that was built for nothing. Look at this. Yeah, it's like there's a huge build up for like, you know, you two put items from like two different times and play different places of the game. What do you get? Oh, you know, you get like this little shack, this little outhouse that happens to have a plate of fire in it. Oh boy. Really? <laughs> really? That's it? Oh, whole deal with me. <laughs> that is disappointing on all sorts of levels, but. But. Now we have everything in the game that we need to. It's backtracking is over. It's time to take all this back to the bust. Oh, uh, no. Uh, portrait that has Tizzle, I mean, um, Carmel. And we can finally see what is happening. Even though we only have three of the four plates, what the game actually hands you the last plate on a silver, or, yeah, the last plate on a silver platter. I was about to say last plate on a silver plate, but I'm like, that's stupid. <laughs> that's dumb. Nah, it's. Yeah, my throat is all sorts of, all kinds of sore right now, and I'm barely an hour into this. <laughs> Not even. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> all right. Whew. Oh, <laughs> bitch. No, not doing this today. Uh, uh I am too close to the end of the game to be doing this bullshit right now. All right. Look at, look at again. This. The final area is not hard to access. You literally just gotta go over here. That's why I'm not bothering to cut right now. I'm just kind of showing you the correct path you need to be taking in order to get there. There we go. Go down. Yes. I will do that. <laughs> I love how he has literally no animation like while he's doing that. Alright. But before we do anything, I want to tell you something. Five flash bombs, 25, 25 potions, eight blood pills, eh, 12 antidotes, eight elemental stones. Guys, I am armed to the goddamn teeth with healing items. And I'm going to save, and it's going to be good. It's going to be damn good. And of course, like before, I'm going to save to a new save file to make sure nothing is going to go awry in the uh, post, and it should be fine. Oh, luckily I've been having pretty good luck with the uh, saving, so shouldn't be too bad. All right, I completely shot over and just putting it in here ne normally. Play of water fits in. Play of fire. Play of wind. <laughs> we are assembling the avatar. Confirmed. Uh. 
What? Oh, hey, Lila. You decided to join him finally. I know what she's. Oh, yeah, she kind of got her ass kicked. Oops, I forgot. I care about Layla that much. <laughs> no one likes Layla. I don't think anyone really cares about Layla that much. This wound is nothing. I must finish the job. Uh, you sure? You really got destroyed there. Well, we're gonna find out pretty soon, aren't we? Dear, are you gonna continue in this risky business after this job is finished? Wasn't it D who asked her that in the movie when he was kind of like buried in dirt? That we just completely turned the tables. All right. Why are we having character development now? Borgov, you're alive. <laughs> but your model isn't. It's clipping through the floor, dude. The owner of this castle is a hideous monster. How about working together? Oh, Jari, doing that. She took me in, didn't she? And do you the sense of the sharpest ever? What are you doing? <laughs> of course, you can't close up on his actual model to show he is in fact a vampire right now. Have you Oops. Lost your mind? You're taking your own sister as a hostage. <laughs> no, stop. Yeah. Oh. Let's put that to the test, shall we? Boom. Nope, not human. <laughs> he just took a shot directly to the forehead. Nope. Still, he's definitely not human anymore. You are a servant of the vampires after all. This is the most D has ever said in the entire game. What the hell? N now he's like, oh yeah, that's right, I have a voice back. And he's coming. Wow, he's coming right at me. You know what? What's he gonna do? Oh, he's gonna run right past me. <laughs> you were charged me straight on with that camera shot. I'm like, nope, nope. <laughs> not doing this. Uh-oh. -uh. We're not playing this game. Anyway, Borgov, vampire now. That doesn't mean shit. He only means this guy he's a little more he has a few more hit points. That's it. So how long until I resort to this? Oh yeah, he can still shoot arrows. But he's got he's got one count him one brand new attack is this one. Where like I sets up like an electrical barrier. Oh god, I am backing up into a wall right now. Why the fuck am I backing up into a wall? No. Get out of here. Motherfucker. I am trapped against something. Against my will. I have no idea what it is. You can avoid that. Guys. Oh my god. I am getting destroyed by... Why? Even? This camera. Oh god. I the funny part is that, like... Oh god. He doesn't like wooden darts too much, does he? You don't like that. You don't like that, do you? This is all normal. This is unnormal. I just killed him with five wooden darts on normal mode. God damn, what the? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you know, corner trapping aside with apparently that move that will destroy you in no time at all. Borgov is relatively the same. What the fuck though? I couldn't do anything. I was... You can normally backdash out of that move. From what I saw. Oh, that I do. I'm not. <laughs> Boop. Oh, 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 now, now headshots work on him. Okay. Okay, apparently she loaded silver bullets this time. <laughs> Alright. So I'm going to assume that if you don't get the gun, that uh, Borgov kind of mauls her there. Alright. The door to the secret passage. The door should open once the last plate is inserted. But this is too easy. You think so? I don't know. Seems kind of straightforward to me. What? You're not gonna take her all by yourself. That's the idea, lady. It's too dangerous. Yep, there is some legit thunder and lightning outside right now. I dare to take the risk. The Marcus brothers never give up on their prey. Even if I'm the only one left, I won't give up. Okay, Layla, real talk. You're legitimately the only person left of the Marcus brothers. And what's your special trait? You have a gun. Congratulations, you're not doing a whole lot right now. I got a present for you, by the way. This is for you. Present for you. <laughs> oh, I can do that too, apparently. Okay, so apparently he has Neji's immediate sleep technique for the first Naruto Shippuden movie. And... That's creepy. That means he can literally just incapacitate anyone he wants at any given time and, like, suck the blood if he wants to. D is scary sometimes, or at least with the powers that he's given in the show. And the series itself. Uh, that's freaky. Fishy. I wonder what Carmilla is up 
I find your son lack of mouth movements to be fishy, bro. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Anyway, my distinct lack of uh, potions right now, or blood pills right now, is kind of... Oops, sorry about that. My, my controller locked every once in a while. Actually, I'm curious about something. Can I go back? I can go back. I wonder what it looks like from the outside. I wonder if there's like an actual hole in the wall now. Uh, yeah, actual hole in the wall now. Hold up, I'm curious. Yep, there's an actual hole in the wall now. Cool. <laughs> Four plates have been inserted in control panel. Okay, cool, we'll go back. we can go back. I hope it doesn't have any weird effect on the game or anything. Which I doubt, but you know, in the off chance it does. Okay, now I'm kind of concerned I'm going to lose power at some point. I'm pretty sure you guys heard that one. Alright, please specify for you what you go to. I don't remember. Uh, I do not remember, honestly. First floor, third floor, first floor. Third floor? Because I'm not on the first floor. Third? Huh? I'm supposed to go to the first floor. I don't know. I don't know what's about to happen right now, honestly. All I know is that there's some super secret door here that's going to take me somewhere. Maybe I should have gone on the first floor. 